Welcome back everyone, I'm Kenpai's Games, this is Diablo 2, and you join me at what I think may be the end of our Nightmare difficulty Javazon run. We are just about to take a portal back to the Wormstone Keep level 2 and go straight into the Wormstone Keep level 3, and just like this. After this is the Throne of Destruction. And all the happy fun time that accompanies that. The Wormstone Keep Level 2 was a gigantic pain in the genital area. It featured all the things we hate and all the things we fear. It had poison and it had lightning immune enemies. A horrible combination. Oh. And these um, lightning immune enemies also, um, mana steel. So yeah, that was happy fun times. But we toughed it out. We made it here. We could have reloaded the game to re-roll the enemies, but I thought no. Let's do it proper. We toughed it out. We made it down here, and the reward for toughing it out was a coal room, the first one we found. Which is part of an extremely powerful shield, which is coal, coal and mal, which adds between 50 and 70 to all your resists, which is enormous. Oh, hello. Chain boots. First set item in a long while. Okay, that um, Coco Mal shield is even better than the four socket shield that I was aiming for, I believe. Resistances wise, at least. And we do tend to use our shield for resists. Our current shield is only adding plus 25 to all resists. But thanks to our rings and amulets and charms. We are almost maxed out on every resist. Um, as we see... Let's just... um. don't even need these anymore. Can't stop, otherwise Bale will shoot me. As we see, uh, Fire 71, Lightning 73, Cold and Poison 75 each. Maxed out. I believe that's the Paladin only one. Yes, we'll leave that down there. Even though Nightmare Difficulty is reducing our resistances by 40, we're still almost maxed out, which is great, even without that Coco Mal shield. Or the four socket one. What is Chaos Armor? Chaos Armor is increased plate mail. Cool. I think that's the stuff we trying to buy for our companion. We tried to do a nice thing for our companion and bought him a really nice set of armor with 555 defense. And we found out he had nowhere near enough strength to use it. So that was a waste of 700,000 gold. Yes, I spent 700,000 gold with before checking if he could equip it. Because I am an idiot. But I think we've recovered all that by now. Let's see what these chain boots are. Has Arasu's iron heel? Yep, good guess. Don't we have something else of his? Yes, we have his iron fist. Let's see what this crappy set is like. 20% faster run mark, fire resist plus 25. And because we're wearing two sets of it, it gets an additional green. Plus 672 attack rating, best on character level. So it makes you more accurate and fast and fire resistant. And because we have two parts of the set, we're getting an additional attacker takes damage of five damage reflect. And the buckler, oh, that's interesting. This gets extra defense based on your character level. Considering this only requires character level three, that could see you for quite some time. But the buckler going up all the time is pretty nice. Don't know what the other part of this is. Right, let's get me booties on. 
before we forget. At your service. Neither of these are worth keeping. No, don't put it in the wrong thing. Put it in here. And there we go. Okay. Um, no. Portal. Or still keep level three. Let's have a go at the throne of destruction. See how bad it is. Here we go. Okay. Normal enemies. These are the usual enemies you find down here. Lots of them and lots of moon lords. The big dudes with twin axes. Yeah, them. Okay, good. That is a boss one now. Let's just smash him. Oh no. These guys are not usually down here. We're smashing things easily enough. I wonder what Bale's minions are going to be. You know he teleports in like four different types of bad guys and they're all from different acts. Very interested to see if it's the same ones he always does. And whether or not any of them are immune to lightning. I'm kind of fearing that. <laughs> but you know what? When we faced Diablo, we changed over to Charge Strike and we melted them in about five seconds. I'm not saying I'm confident. I'm just saying I'm not completely terrified. Maybe hubris will teach me a lesson for not being terrified. Maybe it won't. Right, there is or was a, a boss around here that was cursing everyone. And I don't see a boss. I'm not seeing boss loot. Is he down here? Who cursed us? Why are we cursed? I don't understand. What's going on? Did they die off screen? Oh, I don't understand anything anymore. Okay. Throne room. Here we go. You have to remember that his cold attack is not a cannot be frozen thing. So he will be slowed down by that. Okay. It is the regular people. So I believe, is it the High Council next or is it the um, Act 2 guys? Act 2 guys. God damn poison. Run away, run away. We need to run away until the poison's finished. We need to run away and take some healing potions. I'm not fighting the next layer of bad guys whilst I'm still poisoned from the previous ones, all right? That ain't happening. Even the Valkyrie isn't at full health and she's almost at full health. Okay, her poison is cured. My poison is not, it is still ongoing, but we'll just drink a greater healing potion. Oh, come on. Maybe I should have grabbed a, an antidote potion. Okay, have to be careful. Maybe the next lot spawned and they're waiting for us. No. Lots of loot on the floor. If we survive to pick it up. Uh, who is it now? Oh, there's a high council now, isn't it? Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Wow. That was quite a lot of stuff. Who's left and where is he? You. Wow. Right, let's go and get fixed up in town. I knew that one of the waves at least would be a problem. And it was that wave. Uh, Hello. Don't have anything for Afternoon. you. 33,000 to resurrect him. That is fine. We have plenty of money. Back we go. And this will be the Batwing Demons from Act 4. <laughs> Cannot go beyond these. That's where his area of effect cold thing hits. Come on. Come on. Cast them. Here they come. 
<laughs> okay, now it's his um, devil dudes, which are absolutely huge. This may kill me. Let's split them off. Or, um, or maybe I'll just melt them all. Someone dropped 5,000 gold over there. Um, do we have another super healing potion lying on the floor anywhere? Yes, jolly nice. Thank you very much. I shall put that here. You know what? I think we're just going to go for Belle pretty much right now. Just check we haven't left anything else good on the floor. What the hell is a heater? It's an elite little shield, which is ethereal, so it goes on the floor. Okay, for Belle, we're going to use Charge Strike because it does 1 to 2013 damage. We should probably just drink some healing potions so we're at least full health before we go in. Okay, we can always run away in Town Portal, so then um, let's do it. Let's just rush him. The <laughs> oh, dearie me. Ooh. And that, my friends, is nightmare mode complete. Hello. Shut up, you archangel dick. And, um, he has dropped two uniques, a pair of gauntlets, and a scimitar. We'll see what these are. Is there anything else worth picking up? War Scythe, Ghost Armor, Battle Dart, Quest Log. Quest complete. I will speak to Tyrael in a moment after we have picked up all the gold here. Well, nightmare difficulty was not a nightmare. It was a dream. We absolutely crushed it from the very start of Act 1 to the very end of Act 5. We absolutely beasted this difficulty level. Are we ready for hell? Don't know. We'll find out. Maybe not now, but at some point, because I think we'll do some farming in Nightmare. Yes, yes. Hey, look, he opened the portal this time. Well done. One cutscene later, we are champion, which is this, you get slayer if you complete normal mode, you get a champion when you complete a nightmare. So now we can, if you want, go to hell mode. I'm not going to go to hell mode, I'm going to go to nightmare. And we're going to farm the nightmare dungeons. I can't, I mean, like, as soon as I got to bail and hit him twice with charge strike and I saw he was on, like, two-thirds health, I thought, oh, hello. And, um, yeah. Good day. Javelin Amazons OP. Okay, let's have a look. We have Blood Crescent Scimitar. Very fast attack speed, 15% increased attack speed, 68% enhanced damage, 15% life stolen per hit. That's huge. Plus 33% chance of open wounds, which works like poison, does damage over time. All resistances, plus 15, plus 15 to life, plus 4 to light radius. Excellent, excellent weapon. I will put that on a sword barbarian. And we have Frostburn Gauntlets, Defense 48, plus 5% enhanced damage. Well, that's nice. Adds 1 to 6 cold damage. That's nice. Extra defense, plus 30 defense, increased maximum mana 40%. Nice. So what we need to do on this character now is to pull all this stuff out of here, because it is our farming gear. And store all... No, not that, you idiot. Store all the rest of the stuff in here. In fact, no. Let's not do that. Let's first go to the cow level with all of our good gear on, shall we? Yes, yeah, so let's be clever. We shall begin the farming once we've done the cow level once. And then we shall don all the farming gear and go farming. Uh, we need to buy a couple of potions from Mala. Other than that, we're good to go. Yes, I know. The world stone's dead. It's all very sad. Right, let's get ourselves to the stony field and get Wurt's leg. Let's go! Now, where the heck is the stones? Uh, we're here. The dungeon's there. 
Oh, why am I not seeing the stones? Don't make me go looking for them. That's just rude, man. Wait, well, everything's just gonna... ...do that. Right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Where are the stones? This is the stony field. Aha! I see a portal! Can get back here. Goodbye, I reckon you shoot. Right. Trust them. And trust them should be very quick. Zap. Zap and a couple of jabs. Get the champion group up here. Just annihilate them. Pick up the amulet. That's what we came for. Snake. Two more bosses. <laughs> and back to the rogue encampment. Oh, why does the teleporter have to be so far away from the stones? It's going to make farming a right pain in the tits. But you know what? We'll probably get lots of bosses in between the two of them, so I can't really complain. Back to the rogue encampment. And get Decker Kane to identify these rings. Greetings. And thank you, my friend. And speak to Akara. Welcome back. Yes, indeed. Welcome back. Half freeze duration's nice. Not for us. Sell that. Sell this. Buy one of these. And a one hydrate cube recipe later. Cow level. Okay. We may have to be careful in here. Okay, and the cow king's right here. Literally spawned next to the king. Farming this is going to be hilarious. Don't worry, here's the only thing in here that's immune to lightning. Nothing else is. He didn't drop very much. This place usually drops a ton of stuff. Oh, another character. Get a break from enemies, please. I need to pick up some loot. Okay, uh, what have we got? Hard leather armor, flawless ruby we'll take, um, all the gold we shall take. Um, anything else? Let's put another skill into Power Strike. Right, let's find the edges of the Cow Kingdom. I think we'll just go directly in this way. Okay, we found the edge. Yep. This is um, no more difficult than I found it in normal mode. It's exactly the same. The only difference is... Oh. 
that the loot we're going to get is going to be much higher grade. Move. See, the problem we're going to meet in hell is not just a one hundred minus one hundred resists. The problem we're going to get is that some of our skills are almost nearly maxed out already, so um, we're not going to be able to deal any more damage. I, can't I think carry any more. more and more enemies are going to have more and more resistances. That doesn't do any magic, so throw it on the floor. Pick up this key. Now, I think I will do maybe the same amount of farming I did in normal, which was three runs of six. Three days of farming, no. each doing six tours of seven dungeons. There's a superior grim shield. No. And what is probably Tankred's core bill again. Right, let's pick up some loot. Is that triple socket? No, it's ethereal. On the floor. Oh, I hear you. And I see you. Fill the corners. Fill in the corners. Do it properly. Here we go. Nice. Yeah, the farming will be Countess and Dario, Dario. Maybe lower Kurast for the super chests around the campfires. That will be an eighth optional dungeon. Travancal, Mephisto, um, Pindle Skin, and Cow Level. God, I had to think there for the last two. I'm not going to be farming. Um, oh, mind you. Diablo and Bale did melt. Maybe I'll farm Diablo? I wanted to do this on nightmare mode with all my good combat gear on just to see how difficult it is and it turns out it's not difficult at all. So next time we come back in here we will have something like 230 better magic find. And loot will be spewing out even more than it is now. I can't carry any more. You can't carry any more. No, you can't. Pick it up. Pick that up. Cause yeah, I don't think our um, killing ability is going to be any less than it is now. We just won't be able to take a hit. But then. Um, how many hits have we taken? And not very many is the answer to that. Not very many at all. No. Balls. No. No, I'm not aggressing anyone else. I'm going, I'm going up here. I'm picking up all this loot. Okay, and now. That was too many. Not surrounded. Not good.
Get him. Seize him. You dingus. Okay, we're very, very full. But luckily, the um, teleporter is right here. Yeah, I know there's a lot more cows. We'll come back and get them. Don't you worry about that. Because the portal stays open, see? Where's Decker King? Stay a while and, listen. and then we should... Um, Good day. I was going to say go to Harogoth, but I think everyone's got enough money to buy everything. Well, these are all garbage. That's fairly crap. That can go there. That can get sold. That gets closed. It is indeed Tankridge Crowbell. Let's just compare the stats to the one we have he here. 12 to 19. 12 to 19. It's a double, so it gets sold. That's crap. Garbage, garbage. Don't need it. Alright. Not bad. We haven't even finished the cow level yet. Just 78,000 this time. Not very much. Ooh, a rare amulet. Usually good, sometimes terrible. way. Oh, there's a chest. Locked chest. Let's pick up a key. Thank you. No, don't pick up the crap lock more jacks. Throw it on the floor. Volunteers to the slaughter. Another swirling crystal. I can hear some more. Here they are. And some another little chest there. And I believe that is us done. Not too bad. And that was with a magic find of 25. We'll probably have 225 next time we come back here. But you have to be wary though, because apparently the, um, the portal always opens in the same place. So um, we're always going to appear right next to the Cow King. Look at all this. What's on this with the 17 stamina potions? There's another one there, like. Right. So that was a nightmare cow level. Rating. We know we can survive it. Garage. Good for a necromancer. I ain't a necromancer. Right, that's another perfect duo. We'll just save it until we get another one. Alright, well, let's get the magic thing gear out, shall we? This. 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 That. That. And that. Resistances have gone to hell, but the magic find is 198. That is pretty nice. I'm sure I had a two, over 200 at some point. What was it that was adding that? No, well, whatever it was, we don't have it anymore. Because rhyme adds 25. That's 24. Maybe it was a belt we had. That's 25, that's 25, oh, that's 46. Oh, oh, I know what it is. It was, yes, it was this and this. Yes, it was. Right, so this actually needs to go here and here. 
Because when you do the Arctic binding and and Arctic furs, the Arctic binding gets another 40% better chance of magic items. Which is fine for me. I mean, this is all resist plus 10. That's called resist plus 40. Although we are losing two of our skill levels, um, it's not a huge issue. I'd rather have the magic find for what we're doing. So what we should do is pick up all this. Put this in here and here. And put these in here as well, because why not? I know the magic find should be way over 200. Let's see. Character, advanced stats, 238. Better chance of getting a magic items. Okay, and that's our farming gear. And because the resistances are really crap, I will not be doing Duriel. I will not be doing Diablo. No, I will be doing Duriel. I won't be doing Diablo. I won't be doing Bale. Mephisto might be a problem because his poison resist is 45. But I think we'll melt him fast enough that we won't need Ancient's Pledge. Because I don't want to use Ancient's Pledge because that means losing 25% magic find. So I think that will do us for today. Come back next time and maybe we'll um, go through the first farming run together. So come back for that and we'll run seven or eight different locations together the first time. And then I'll probably go away and do it another 17 times and we'll have a look at the results of all the juicy gear that we got. Until then, do look after yourself. That's the end of Nightmare Mode, folks. Look after yourself and I'll see you later.